I knew I was done. I knew I couldn't do this anymore. Um, I decided to detox myself on my couch. And so I didn't know anything about the disease of alcoholism and the physical effects that it can have um, and that you could potentially die. And so on day four, I was feeling a lot better and I told my fiance, let's go to Walmart. And um, I remember just grabbing him and saying, I don't feel good. And the next thing I know, I'm having a seizure in Walmart um, in front of tons of people. And then I woke up in the hospital. I had a huge blockage in my liver. And so nothing was being processed through my liver, um, especially alcohol, but nothing, no food, no um, pills, nothing was being processed through my liver. So I ultimately had um, surgery and they took out a huge portion that was a blockage in my liver. Um, and you'd think that I would stop at that time. And I was gonna stop, I was determined to stop, but you come back home, you're feeling good, you're detoxed. And this is what happens if you don't go straight from that worst to, to drug and alcohol treatment. Um, they sent me back home, I was feeling better, and then the brain kicks in and it's like, oh, you could just have one drink, you're done now. You don't have that blockage in your liver anymore. And so, little by little, I started drinking again, and then within days, it was right back to full-blown addiction.